In this video, I'll be demonstrating how to use GIMP to apply the rule of thirds to your photographs. The rule of thirds is a technique used in photography that helps you to position important objects within your image. So I'll show you how this works. First select the Rectangle Select tool, which is this button right here. Now use this tool to select most of your image. And then go over to the Tool Options and down towards the bottom, there's a drop-down menu. Select Rule of Thirds from this menu. And now when you do that, you'll notice that it added two vertical lines and two horizontal lines to the selection box. The idea behind the Rule of Thirds is that you want important parts of your photograph to line up with one or more of these lines. So for example, one important element of this photograph is our horizon. So we'll want to line our horizon up with one of these guidelines. So let's resize our selection box until this bottom horizontal guideline lines up with the horizon. So we'll put it about right there. So another aspect to using the rule of thirds is if there's an important element in your photograph that you want people to focus on, then put that element in a position where a horizontal and a vertical line cross. And with the grid lines that we have here, there are four different spots where these lines cross. Right here, 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 and here. So this sailboat right here is an interesting element in this photograph. So let's line it up with the position where this line crosses this line. And so let's change the size of the selection box again. So we now have this horizontal guideline lining up with the horizon, and we have the point where this line and this line cross lined up with the sailboat. Now let's crop our image to this selection. So go to the Image menu and select Crop to Selection. And then let's zoom in on this picture. So go to the View menu, select Zoom, and Fit Image in Window. So I have a copy of this original photo, so let's compare the two. Here's the original, and then this is after we applied the rule of thirds. So let's do another one now. So here we have our photograph, and I've still got the rectangular selection tool selected. So I'm just going to select most of this image. And when using a photograph of a person, the rule of thirds is often applied by lining up the eyes with one of the horizontal lines. So let's rescale this selection until this horizontal line here lines up with the center of the two eyes. And let's also line up this vertical line until it's also in the center of the eyes. And we're also using the point at which these two lines cross to draw people's attention to that point. So now let's crop this image. So again, we'll go to the Image menu and select Crop to Selection. And then let's zoom in on this image by going to the View menu, select Zoom, and then Fit Image and Window. So this is our original photo. And this is after we've now applied the Rule of Thirds. So you can see that the composition of this image seems to be more interesting than the original. So let's try one more. So let's start by selecting this image. And an important element in this image is the horizon that stretches across the photograph. So let's line up our top guideline with the horizon. And we also have these trees here that are close to this vertical line. So let's go ahead and line this vertical guideline up with this tree right here. And when we crop this image, we're going to lose all of this area down here, but it's not really very interesting anyway. So let's go ahead and crop our image, and then zoom in on it. So here's our original image, and then this is after applying the rule of thirds. 
So you can see that the rule of thirds feature that GIMP has is a nice tool for helping you to compose your photographs. Well that concludes this video. Thanks for watching and please subscribe and leave a comment.